not the sort of shots you'd normally expect to have on a night out at a club. On the dance floor of this London venue, people are getting their dose of the Covid vaccine. Well, I'm actually in a musical in the West End at the moment, round the corner, and I've just finished a show and I noticed that this was open. It's like such a good thing for like the youth um, to be like, look, this is where we're at. You know this place, you feel comfortable here, so just come along and get your jab. For the first time, nightclubs, including Heaven in central London and the Nightingale in Birmingham, are being used as temporary vaccination clinics to try to encourage more young people to get the jab. In the same way that different communities have gone into, whether it be a synagogue or a mosque, wherever they go to try and target different communities, we can target a younger audience. Other attempts to target a younger age group include the Surrey theme park Thought Park, offering jabs at a pop-up clinic, the festival Latitude hosting a vaccination bus and free food and live music at a vaccine festival in the London borough of Tower Hamlets. More incentives are planned, such as discounts on Deliveroo meals and Uber journeys. From September, the government says unvaccinated people won't be able to enter nightclubs and other large-scale events. But how effective can the carrot-and-stick approach be? 23-year-old Sam Duffy was keen to get the vaccine as soon as he was eligible. His twin is the opposite. These Covid passports and stuff come in later in the year. He's not going to be able to go out to any bars, clubs, things like that. So, yeah. Why is he hesitant? He, a lot of online stuff, he kind of, you know, reads the misinformation about it, uh, a bit sceptical. Uh, he doesn't, a bit nervous about the long-term side effects of it. Latest figures show that while vaccine hesitancy is falling slightly among the young, just under 70% of 18 to 29 year olds have had their first jab, compared to just under 90% of the wider adult population. But the NHS lead at this pop-up clinic says young uptake is proportional to the relatively short time they've been eligible for the vaccine. I'm not sure if it's really about young people, really, because actually we still have a lot of people who are older and other sort of vulnerable sort of populations that are still not vaccinated yet. Work continues on finding ways to get more of the population jabbed. These young people, at least, are now part of that club. Lakshmi Gopal, BBC News.